Happy Easter! Today's lessons come from a very important book, and that book is called the Bible. The Bible, that's right. And the Bible is what? God's Word. God's Word. And the Bible is divided into two big parts. The first part is called the the Old Testament. And the second part is called the? New Testament. The New Testament. And the Old Testament is everything before Jesus is born. And the New Testament starts with Jesus' birth and his life. That's right. And so today we're going to talk about a story that comes from the New Testament. And the New Testament starts with four very important books called the Gospels. And the Gospels mean? Good news! And the first four books, say them with me, are Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John. And today's story is from Matthew. And we're going to talk about today's lesson being a big surprise. I know everybody likes a surprise, right? So I brought a gift right here, a very special gift. What do you think's in there? A toy. A toy? You think so? I have a gift, and what's inside? Actually, it's empty, but hallelujah. Listen to today's story about how Jesus surprised us and how something being empty was such a great gift for all of us. So today, you can turn into your Bible to Matthew to listen to the empty tomb and learn how the women went to find Jesus and the stone actually had been rolled away and it was empty. Jesus was no longer there. Jesus is alive. Hallelujah. At our church on every Easter Sunday, we have a very special tradition of putting flowers inside of a really big cross that sits out in front of our church. And I just wanted to take a minute to talk about the symbol of the cross. And the cross symbolizes Jesus' victory over death. Jesus is alive. Isn't it awesome to know that God is bigger than any of our problems, any of our fears, our worries, that we can know that God is with us and He is for us and God loves you very, very much. Thank you.